With emphasis by the current government on free quality education in Sierra Leone, it is hard to imagine that schools within the capital city could be in such deployable condition and without adequate seating. Quality education, they say, is a combination of a supportive environment with motivated and educated teachers to meet the needs of pupils. Lack of inadequate seats and poor infrastructure are among the major challenges facing the CLA Muslim Bodau at Oldfield Street. The, the most important issue at hand is that of the seating accommodation. But when we do it to a, a, a situation where we feel we are comfortable, we go to the doors. We don't have doors, fortified doors. We are always in the mercy of thieves around the area. They steal our benches, our chairs, and everything that is, that is school property. With cracks all over the building and leaking roof, the school seems more like a dead trap rather than a learning facility. We need zinc for the school. Most of the zinc has been flown off by the breeze. So we, we need zinc, not even, I think at, at least 10, 10 of them to, to cover the to building. And again, we have one big classroom. It's like an entertainment center because it is not partitioned and it's difficult. It does not encourage conducive learning. Children see each other as the teaching goes on and that should not be. It should be partitioned. They could hear the voice of others in other classes, but they should not see each other. It distracts the attention of the children. So we need partitioning for that big uh, uh, parlor. I, I, I refer to it as parlor because it doesn't resemble a classroom. There's not in the if schools in the capital city are in such deployable condition, one could imagine the condition of schools in hard to reach rural communities. One at Jumovia, AYV News, Frita.